Hey guys, it's Rockstar Chuck E. Cheese here. Hey, Andy, how you doing? Well, I'd like to welcome you to your first day as a star. You know, you have a huge butt. When you come to work, your day, I guess want a huge butt. And that's what we give them. If you're on location, if you're on location, <laughs> it's showtime. Uh, what am I so, doing Chucky, here? I hear you have this uh, uh, attitude. What are you talking about? When people I don't know what you mean. Get too close to you, you trip no, out. Is that true? That's not true. What's your problem, man? What are you man? doing? Get away from me. What, you want a piece of me? Oh, yeah, I want a piece of you. What? 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 Alrighty then, my royal chums, it is I, Daniel, but you may call it the pop culture dude, and today, we're gonna talk about a news where a place that you love, where a kid can be a kid, but it's Chuck E. Cheese. Of course, that's why I refer to that slogan, but the most amazing thing is you can heard that it's getting its brand new animated series for the young generation to enjoy. So your childhood dreams may come back if you were born in the 70s, 80s, or 90s, or else you just grow up as in the 2000s. Or there's some childhood fears that you must fear. Yeah, until then, you're not going to get an animated series, but a live action movie of Chuck E. Cheese. And that is the most ridiculous idea I've ever heard in my entire life. <laughs> Anyway, enough with all the sarcasm anyway, but yes, you heard me right. Chuck E. Cheese is getting a brand new animated show and a live action movie. And your question, probably in the comments, is why? Why are they making it? Well, I read this on this news article and I'm going to read this with my handy dandy tablet. It says right here, Chuck E. Cheese is planning an animated TV show and a live action movie starring its mascot, Mouse. Huh, it probably might be getting the Rugrats treatment, where it's getting a revival on Nickelodeon, which is animated, and then that was gonna get a live action movie from Paramount, so, eh, at least that was canceled, but the revival thing, that's still happening. But this is about Chuck E. Cheese, so, basically it says right here, Chuck E. Cheese, CEO David McKillop says the children's diner entertainment company just launched an entertainment division in a recent interview with Business Insider. The entertainment division will focus on merchandising and toys at first. Obviously, you gotta make it the money. You gotta make more plushies of this where it can't get me again. <laughs> so yeah, obviously for the merchandise. So that's the first focus when it comes to a business strategy. So <clears throat> let me continue. So, but McKillop says that breaking into script entertainment is part of the company's strategic vision and one of its pillars of growth. Ideally, we will love to have Chuck E. Cheese in animation and possibly one day a movie feature as well. <laughs> Big Phil has told Business Insider, so he pretty much confers that. He, the, okay, I think that there's a theory that I want to continue more of the story, but first, before I get to the article, let's just talk about a deep story. Chuck E. Cheese is a franchise that's been running for almost like what? almost 45 years since 1977 and the fact that it's going bankrupt why because of <coughs> the pandemic that's going on throughout the entire world and you don't want kids to get sick and need of the parents so that'll be some concerns with their health conditions so the thing is like well what can we do to not get bankrupt and try to keep our franchise going you don't want to become the next toys r us where it goes bankrupt and then it goes gone forever and then you're gonna miss be like gonna miss my childhood so the thing is like what they're gonna do make more merchandise toys an animated show and a movie it's all about franchise and merchandise Chuck E. Cheese is trying to make money you can feel the CEO coming you must make this a franchise you should not leave the legacy die so let me continue on with the article by saying according to Chuck E. Cheese CEO David McKillop's America's most Famous animatronic mouse, not Mickey Mouse, not Freddy Fazbear, and obviously that's a bear, but not a mouse, but you get the point. So it goes in by continuing. The most famous animatronic mouse wants to make it big in Hollywood. 
In a recent interview with Business Insider, McKellen said the children's entertainment company just launched an entertainment division. The entertainment division is going to focus on merchandising and toys at first, but McKillick said, The break into script of entertainment is the company's strategic controls of one, and ideally we would love to have a Chuck E. Cheese movie. So, McKillick's confident that Chuck E. Cheese character popularity will be a hit with the kids for our demographics from 4E to 8 years old. <laughs> Makes sense, because no one in my elementary school by ages 10 to 12 will be like, Chuck E. Cheese is for babies. Well, that's why they target it for kids, so their parents could get their wallets on and waste their money for their kids for all the pinballs and the pizzas. That is, I don't know, could be a conspiracy theory thanks to Shane Dawson. So, let's continue on. For our demographic of three to eight year olds, he's one of the most popular characters in the world, he said. The division is still new, so Mikkel has declined that there's so many contract plans, so there will be more into details. Chuck E. Cheese has been harmed by a pandemic leads to his parent company, CAC. Chuck E. Cheese, that's what it stands for. Entertainment filing for Chapter 11 Bankruptcy Protection in June. To dig in the chain of the diva financial trouble, Mikhail Tlaiyal plans to address some of the most pressing problems well as a vision for long-term brand transformation. See, I already told you, just to keep the franchise love and obviously to make more money so it obviously won't be forgotten and it won't go bankrupt. Anyway, my thoughts on the animated show. So, that could work because you got fictional characters. You got Chuck E. Cheese, you got Helen, who's obviously a bird, you got Jasper, who's a dog, you got Munchie, who's like a monster that goes, I'm the, I'm the, and you got the best squad leader, how does I'm this mouth and veggie just for you? <laughs> and obviously, that could work as an animated show. Live action movie, however, first off, what's it gonna be? Is it gonna be like those Muppet treatments, like they're talking like puppets, like ah, 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 ah. Or is it gonna be animatronic, where it's gonna be the dark and grittier Chuck E. Cheese? It's the original Five Nights at Freddy's movie before Five Nights at Freddy's ever existed as a fully feature, like the banana splits, one banana, two banana, three banana, four. So, is it gonna be like a dark and grittier Chuck E. Cheese? I doubt that because the main target for its audience are the children. So, like we said, if it comes to a live action movie, are these characters are gonna be CGI like you see in the commercials? Or are they gonna be like live action photorealistic animals? Uh, meow? And then you're gonna get backlash at so many dislikes and then you're gonna redesign the character. We've been through that with the blue hedgehog before. So, an animated show, that could totally work for the children and that will definitely like bring the franchise alive and decided to make the profits go a little bit more just to extend it to contain the legacy. So the animated show, that could work for the kids. I have a film that's gonna end up in a streaming service. And as for the full length feature film, what studio is gonna picture it? Disney, Warner Brothers, Paramount, Sony, Universal, I don't know, but I don't know. With this thing, this whole idea, I get the purpose of it, but it just feels weird. What do you guys think of a live action Chuck E. Cheese movie and an animated TV show? But anyway, whew, I am out of breath. I'm gonna need to drink some water, but that's it for today's video. I'm just gonna go sit down and I don't know. I'm just gonna go order me some Chuck E. Cheese pizza unless the ingredients are real. So thank you guys for watching. Take care now. Bye bye then. Where a kid can be a kid. Woo! Won't you come see about me? I'll be alone. Dancing, you know it.